Alright guys, welcome back to episode 7 of my hardcore series. Today we're going to be building a farm for all types of crops. Um, it's going to be pretty big. I got a lot more doggos. Um, but come with me as I build this uh, farm. Yeah! It's 30 minutes mining and mining and mining. Not realizing my microphone was muted. So now my microphone is unmuted. Basically, what I am doing is I'm digging all this down. I got rid of all of my cane. And I'm going to make this one big farm for all um, plants. For that. Eventually, I'm going to do berries. So, because I can trade with those. I can also trade with a bunch of potatoes or wheat or whatever. I got to trade with a lot of that. And then I'm going to make like a trading villager hub behind this like into that man
All right, guys. So I'm gonna plant this real quick. We have completed this. Um, so we have wheat, potatoes, carrots, and freaking crab, man. Really? I legit just finished that. I'll fix that in a minute. I need to put fences all up there, but I took fences up there to keep it up, the mobs out. But we finished it. Um. So, yeah. Um. Next video. Um. I'll do a little spoiler. There's a good chance. Next video. I'm gonna do a little spoiler. There's a good chance I'll be doing something or another, so stay tuned for that. I'm kinda excited and nervous. <sighs> I have a stack of fences. And my shovel did break, so I like enchanted that. So that's why I have um, very low levels. What in the world? Now they can't like get past this fence. I'm not done with the fence, but I'm just saying. Okay, Mr. Tree. Deforestation. Deforestation. Alright guys, so I finished planting everything and I took off a little while to let it all grow. I do have a texture pack tell me when things are done growing. But we have carrots, we have potatoes, we have a whole bunch of wheat. Dang it! And that's pretty much all. I did make this little thing off camera. Just look at AFK. The farm. Um but thank y'all so much for watching. Make sure to like sub and subscribe and c comment down below because I love reading your comments. Anyway, peace.